The next type of linear RF resonant accelerator is the traveling wave accelerator. They are utilized for the acceleration of particles that almost reach the speed of light. Historically, their primary goal was to accelerate electrons, but now such structures are used to accelerate heavier particles with high energies. The challenge of a traveling electromagnetic wave acceleration is that the phase speed of an electromagnetic wave in a smooth circular waveguide is always higher than the speed of light. The acceleration needs to be done with a wave, the speed of which corresponds to the particle speed. That is why the wave in the waveguide has to be slowed down. The simplest decelerating structure that emerged before others was a round waveguide loaded with diaphragms the so-called round diaphragm waveguide. Decelerating structures may be more complex. For example, they may be a chain of strongly bound resonators. From one end, a traveling wave is injected into the waveguide. It runs through the entire waveguide and then goes into the matching load. Along the waveguide axis, a beam is moved with a speed exactly equal to the wave speed and it takes energy away from the wave. Two accelerators of this type operate at the Joint Institute for Nuclear Research. One of them is the accelerator of the IREN facility, the Intense Resonance Neutron Source. How is the source designed? The 200 mega electron volt accelerator is arranged vertically, with its beam reaching the assembly unit either from a fissionable or a heavy substance, for instance tungsten. In this substance, in the target substance, the emergence of neutrons takes place, which are then used for various experiments. These are experiments in solid-state physics and in material science. Another accelerator that uses traveling wave structures is called Linac 800. Today, it is still active at the Jelyapov Laboratory of Nuclear Problems. It is used as a driver for free electron lasers, as well as for testing the elements of various detection equipment. Besides that, on the basis of this accelerator, a department at our Educational Scientific Center, Jinnar University Center, has been created to hold practical student classes on various disciplines, such as vacuum engineering, high-frequency technology, industrial electronics, linear accelerators, free electrons lasers, and radiation safety. Since 2015, international student groups undergo practical training at this accelerator. It is planned that it will become a training facility for specialists for all member states of our institute.